eCompare consists of two elements, which are the plugin itself and an accompanying theme. Now the theme can be completely edited or customized to meet the user needs and to fit any area of interest or niche. So I'll just quickly skip through the theme options so you can see the extent of which users are able to customize or edit. So pretty much everything you see here can be edited. Now we'll take a look at the plugin itself. So you can see in the menu here, product finder, which is a page that we're on right now, dashboard, blogger, and settings. So first of all, I'm gonna show you settings, and you can see here that we have seven platforms that we can integrate into our site. And those are Amazon, AliExpress, Walmart, Best Buy, Shop.com, Cdiscount, and eBay. Now, in order to connect these sites with the eCompare package or the eCompare site, a user would simply click here, fill in the details, put in the access keys and the secret key, depending on which platform they're using and so on, and then save settings. Now, once everything is set up, the user's affiliate or referral link is globally embedded. So whenever somebody searches for a particular product and runs a live price comparison, whichever product they choose to purchase has the site owner's affiliate link embedded. Now, there are a couple of ways of adding products, but perhaps the easiest one is to come over to Product Finder, drop in the keyword here and the category here, and any search filters that you want to use, such as low to high price, high to low price, best sellers, keyword relevancy, highest to lowest ratings, etc. So you can choose to filter using those options. You can add products under a specific category. So if you have a number of categories already set up on the site, then you can do that. Here, you can see this is just a demo site, so we don't have anything specific set up. But the idea is to target these sites to specific markets, interest, niches, so once you do add your product there, you simply click Fetch Products and the app will pull in the relevant products for you. Now, once the products are added, you can choose to make them visible. You can show them on your shop. You can add them to the features list, in which case they'll show up on the front page, or you can choose to remove them from either. You'll see that we have a stock checker included. So if a particular product is out of stock, then it will show up here and be detected by the plugin. Prices are also auto checked. So if the price changes once you've added that product, then the price is automatically changed when that product listing price is changed on the platform. For the product listing themselves, all of the details are pulled from Amazon. So all of the listing details, the images, reviews, everything is pulled from Amazon. However, everything can be edited just like any other WordPress post. Now this is something that the user would have to do manually with the front end product, but we do have a content spinning feature in OTA one. You'll see that we can also add relevant videos, review videos from YouTube and Vimeo. And let me quickly show you this particular post so you can see how it works. Let's pull this screen up a tad. So you can see the image here, and then the comparison takes place here. Now, although there are seven platforms incorporated, obviously not every product will be listed on every one of those platforms. So the comparison engine searches all of them and delivers the results from the platforms that carry that particular stock. So you can see here that if you wanted to purchase this cycle, then Walmart would be the cheapest option. And then if I scroll down here, you can see that the description is added. Again, this can be edited. It delivers reviews from Amazon. And over time, some users may choose to leave reviews on your site as well. Now going back to the video option, you can see that we've added a couple of videos that relate to this particular cycle, and they've been added just below the actual listing. Now, again, you don't have to have these here, but the option is there if users want to use it. So the homepage would look something like this, obviously with users edits on board. 
So as I say, it can be completely customized. Everything that you see here is included in the front end. I'll take you to the shop. Now this probably isn't a great example because it's a demo site, so it's not targeted. So there's a little of everything on this site, but I'm sure you can imagine if you'd set this up to sell, say, camping and hiking gear, then it would work really well, or any area of interest or any niche at all. But I'll just scroll down so you can see how this works. So a shop front would look like this. Again, it can all be edited from blog, which is useful for driving organic traffic and SEO. The plugin and theme also comes with pre-configured legal pages. So it's simply a case of loading those up. So let me run this very quick demonstration for you. So let's assume that I was looking for a coffee machine or a coffee maker. Let's put that in there. So the longy coffee machine and we'll choose a kitchen and best sellers and fetch products okay so you can see that it pulls in the relevant products so if i wanted to i'd say that one or that one or maybe even that one all i would do is click there just click on the items that you'd like to add to your store like so and then add those products. So now you can see that the app has added these three products to the website. Okay, so these are added to your store. Now here we have the option to share on Facebook, to post on Twitter, and to pin on Pinterest. Now this gives the user the ability to drive traffic without any cost whatsoever. So let me share this one on Facebook and you can see how this works. So you can see that the image that you share is actually the price comparison. So it's actually taken from the new post. So anybody on Facebook or Pinterest or Twitter who may be interested in your particular products will see that you have the best deal and the best price. So anybody clicking this link would go directly to that post. And of course, it can be shared on your own timeline on a friends, in a group, an event, on a page that you manage, or you can share this as a private message. So to demonstrate how this works, let me just show you how it looks when I share it. So I click there, you can see that it pops up here. So this is my timeline and you can see our advert there. And then if I click here, the user can see the actual listing on your site. And you'll see below the listing are related products, the description and any reviews pulled directly from Amazon.